issue is it fits just fine and it doesn't minimize the screen any more than we really have to. Yeah, Ranger, nah. Okay, so the reason here why I say Ranger is because it has the thing about favored enemies and the fact that you're trying to focus on specifically spell-like abilities means you have a developed interest in specific creatures. And therefore, yes. the fact that you're focusing on creatures and not so much on the magic itself as the creatures that have magic means that that particular topic was what was drawing me to that idea. All right, so that one ab class ability, it, it works, but the combat style, the other the thing is casting... The other thing that I could throw in as an argument is, especially since you don't want to be a fight-for-kill type of thing, is if you could get the idea of tranquilizers and be ranged at shooting tranquilizer weapons then that means that your proficiency in ranged weapons would make sense as a ranger. Alright, I'd almost go more alchemist if I'm using chemical weapons. And then... What were the other things that you were saying about it, though? I mean, the combat style doesn't really fit. The divine casting... Okay, so, but again... Animal companions, the whole nature event. But again, it. as we've said, with divine casting, the fact that it's divine doesn't really matter in the way that we're playing our game. So divine part is irrelevant. I also just don't like rangers. Why do you not like rangers? Because it's just... Rangers are like rogues with guns, except for that there are gun no, rogues that are th also rogues with guns. That's not what they are at all. Okay, they're like druid rogues. That's what a ranger is. They're like druid fighters. No, they have a lot in common with rogues as well. I mean, they have a little bit, but they're mainly like... They're very like... The classic rangers are their... Archer or dual wielder, which feel like just. Which are both things that rogues do a lot too. It feels very <laughs> unfocused as a class. Okay, well, like, you're ignoring of my idea then was basically you not acknowledging the things that I was arguing. <laughs> What's this? Uh, the multiplayer things. Huh. You don't even know what it is we're doing, but you're having fun with this. Plus, the other thing about Ranger that works is they're a skill-based class. That, uh, kind of. No, very. Moderately. They're not so, as skill-based as a Rogue, but that's because bard. Rogue is the most skill-based. Bards also have them beat, but, yeah, I mean, they're moderately skill-based. Yeah, but the thing about that is, bards are basically magic rogues, except for the rogues that are also magic yeah. rogues. <laughs> oh, you're gonna start a having to fight the mans. It's fine. What? What? Oh, sorry, I, what do I do with that? <laughs> Just go over there. Yeah, I don't remember the controls. Excuse me. Oh yeah, these are weirdos. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? They're weirdos, I just remembered. Excuse me. Oh, please stop. When I start shooting you, you have to stop. Kill them with telekinesis, it says it at the top. Wait, can I kill those? Yes. Yes, you can, because sometimes you have to chase them. Because they will spawn more guys. Sonic the me! Excuse me. I will say... Oh, whoops, you're my enemy! I will say, this has a lot of fun and cool things to it. Like, a lot of fun and cool things cool to it. Cool and good things? But, they're not anywhere near as cool. And, er, they don't have as much of a sense of balance as 3 did. Help! Oh, there's a bad man. So I will say, even though 4 is really cool, I am one of those people who liked 3 more than 4. Really? Yeah. Like, again, don't get me wrong, there's some really freaking cool stuff that comes from this that I really enjoy. But Like this. But at, at the all. end of the day, everything in this game is either 
you automatically smash it and there's nothing to worry about, or it's confusingly difficult and you just can't even succeed. There's no in-between. There's no, like, stuff that's kind of tricky, but once you start figuring it out, it's satisfying to do again and again. It's either you just go around killing all the mans, like this. There is a lot of it, and they never stop. Or it's on a thing that's on a time limit, and you can't figure out what you're needing to do, and bad things happen, and it Please makes people stop sad. Where are the bullets coming from? Gotta fuck you off the roof again. Oh no, I'm falling! You're taking damage a lot. I know. Oh, I just, I just sort of stepped on him. Oh, there you are. This is your most effective attack. Yeah, just general melee because I think it also heals you a bit. And yep, now uh, they're on this roof again. That's some serious power bombing. There isn't any game footage in the stream. Oh. That's okay, all we've been doing is punching some guys. Mouse, please, thank you. This is why I don't like it when things resize, because then I can't see it as easy. When I Ranger it. also does nothing with intelligence. Yeah, but again, we're going to probably be augmenting the class, and so there's ways to adjust that. Because it's originally wisdom-based, isn't it? Yes. So... He's already said there are several times where he will switch intelligence and wisdom because there's some times where you have a variation where it just makes more sense to be the other one. I forget how to use my super pow crazy powers other than the... Like for um, Korra, we're switching from adept from uh, intelligence to wisdom because she's more wisdom proficient and the things make just as much sense to be wisdom as they do to be intelligent. All right, who's shooting me? Oh, you were. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead already. There's one of those spawner ball thingies. Oh! <laughs> well, there's also men. Yeah, but if you kill the spawner ball, it will make less men happening. Yeah, but if I kill the men, they'll, that'll all make... The... There are too many mans! Yeah. All right, because... well, like, stop it. Just shoot the spawner ball. I'm going to get shot at. You're gonna get shot at both ways. Now this way I can keep moving. See, I have all these special powers, but I really don't feel I can afford to... <laughs> <laughs> that poor guy! He just wanted to get home. Oh, hi. Hmm, something doesn't seem right here. <laughs> do you feel better now? <laughs> Everything's fine. The best part was it didn't do the animation. You just stood there going, Oh no, I'm falling! <laughs> For some reason. Oh, hey, health. Hey, I'm a vampire. You're a collector of vampires. Oh yeah, that's how you disable it. Oh yeah, I just punch him in a lot. And that converts it. No, that's not it. Oh no, I'm falling. <laughs> My powers work. <laughs> but instead, no, I'm just I'm just falling. Slayers of telekinesis, all of them seem to just. Oh, I'm about to die. I need to vampire some people. <laughs> That's how people die, right? By vampiring them? Oh, yeah, no, I heal by just resting, not by murdering everyone. I mean, you do heal a little bit from murdering everyone as well. 
We also draw aggro. Mm -hmm. oh, that's how. Oh, life steal telekinesis. That might help. Okay, just <laughs> you equip myself with the important controls. <laughs> How to falling. Which ones? Uh, wizard and no, I mean, wizard, alchemist. Wizard and, and alchemist are the ones I'm really thinking on. Artificer and the ones that he hasn't made yet. No, no, I'm, those ones I'm mostly saying yes to. I'm based on between wizard and alch one of the many, many alchemists. Where is all the thing? Yeah. Don't put words in my mouth. I'm saying yes to the one. I'm saying no the least to the ones he's suggesting. But you're still saying no to them. I'm saying maybe. Is that what I wanted, my Do what? That red bar, that was my health, but... No, the red bar is your wanted level. Oh, whoops. The blue bar is your health on the right side. Oh, there's a Pokeball over here. I forget what to do about you, but I want they're to... The, they're the, if you kill them, your wanted level automatically stops. Oh, well, I'm not that wanted, so I don't care. Ow. Oh, yeah, my health bar's over there. It's fine. Just, I'm just on fire. Ah, here we are. It's time to do that thing again. Hello, come on. starting a campaign like this, uh -huh. you get basically two extra feats out of the situation. That seems like a bit much, but that's what it appears to be, yes. Yeah, you get one that's kind of more that being completely said, dictated, and then basically one that the you, one you get completely. The one you get as... That one, though, it tends to be made obsolete by your choice of class. If you're using the exact basic stock classes. And not necessarily, because, like, um, the one for Druid, it basically means you can choose extra skills that you wouldn't have before, because you already have three or four spells brought in with you when you start. Oh, it doesn't just give you Druid spells? It gives you, like, four Druid spells. Oh. Hmm. One of them, I think, and it's once per day. Weird. Or something. I can't remember. 
I haven't read it in a while. You must die. I read it like four or five. See, this never stops showing up. Yeah, because you're not getting rid of the spawner things. The what? red glowing oh. spawner things make more enemies. There's just so many glowies, okay? I know, but I tried to tell you that earlier. You're like, but it's there's 